So, you've gathered your supplies, you've gotten or purchased the eggs, and now you've got caterpillars. Noodle-like, eat you out of your home, caterpillars. Now what? First off, you gotta get a suitable container. In my case, I've got this big glass one. Oh, and there's little Leafy becoming a chrysalis that has vents on top. It's a pretty simple setup, but it works. There's also mulch and wet rocks on the bottom. Now I bought this with the caterpillars already in there, and he said it would only take about three to five days for them to become a chrysalis, but it's only taken about one. Of course, Marigold, the one you're seeing crawl across the screen, probably isn't gonna go into that J shape until either late tonight or in the morning. So once you've got your good cage, you're also going to need their plants. So I've got cloudless sulfurs. That's not the name of the plant, it's the name of the caterpillar. I don't know exactly what these plants are. I'm going to do some more research, but the guy at the shop, he absolutely assured me that these would work on them. And it has. They've been eating it. They don't seem sick. They're strong. They're healthy. So I'd say it's a pretty big success. Also, sometimes they'll eat the flowers, so if you can put part of the flowers from the plant in there, that'd be a good idea. So make sure that there's no shards or anything potentially dangerous in there, or any predators. Kill off any other bugs, um, remove any little pieces of glass or wood or anything like that, except for this mulch, which is very safe for them. They've fallen onto it a few times before, just like Lima Bean did, but they've been fine. This isn't focusing. Okay. <laughs> but anyways, you just got to make sure that you feed them every day, that you miss their cage. If you have one as ventilated as mine, this isn't necessary. I've done it once so far and they seem to be okay. Do this about once every one to two days, especially if it's hot out. If it is hot out, make sure to do it once a day, and if it's really cold out, I'd suggest only doing it three times a day if you're keeping them on a porch, or if you keep your house really cool. I said three times a day instead of once every three days, didn't I? <sighs> once every three days, do it. And then just wait for them to go into their little shape. Now, some of them do the traditional J shape to hang, but some of them also make kind of like a U-shaped hammock, like my little leafy here. Come on, focus. Okay, well, my little green blob here. But yeah, just as long as you follow those tips, making sure there's no predators, misting, having the appropriate plants, you should be okay. This Lepidopterus creations, and I'll see you next time.